Hello everybody, this is Jeff at eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a look at the Kodiak Disc Brake Kit with the 10-inch Dacker Mad Hub Rotors, 5 on 4 and a half inch bolt pattern, and these are for 3,500 pound axles. Now these are a marine grade brake assembly to make it very easy to change from a drum to a disc brake system for a lot better performance on your trailer. The disc brakes will deliver better performance than drum brakes because it will give you more consistent stopping even at highway speeds and also dramatically shorter stopping distances. Also the maintenance costs are lower than for drum brakes because you have fewer moving parts that you have to maintain, repair, or replace. Now this kit here is for everything laid out here on the table. It includes two full brake, drum, or two full brake assemblies. It starts with the two Dacromat coated one piece hub and rotor assemblies. The two Coda Guard coated calipers with the ceramic pa brake pads on them. The four stainless steel caliper mounting bolts that will install the calipers. And then right here, the DAC two of the Dacromat coated caliper mounting brackets. Now the hydraulic brake actuator and brake lines are required for brakes to be activated. Those we do sell separately on our website. And it will require a PSI rating of at least 1500 PSI for disc brakes. Now this does offer superior corrosion resistance for marine applications. I want to zoom in and show you. They use a nice Dacromat coating on the hub and rotors and on the brackets. It has a 300 to 400 hour salt spray rating. And on the calipers they use this blue Codeguard coating that has a 600 hour salt spray rating. Now the hub and drum assemblies, they are a one piece hub and drum assembly. They do have a rotor diameter of 10 inches. They do minimize lateral runout to prevent any warping. They do provide a nice smooth ride with a balanced hub and rotor combined. And they also prevent heat related damage because you can see it has the vented design to it and this will effectively dissipate the heat that builds up. Now this rotor does use the industry standard bearings and seals which we do sell separately on our website and we do list the part numbers that fit on this on the product page of this product. The bearing races are actually pre-installed. <clears throat> now the cast iron calipers right here they are self-adjusting for a nice smooth equal braking. They are a cast iron construction so they don't flex like aluminum and they are a low drag design so it retracts the piston further than other calipers for a cooler running brake. And I wanted to show you the piston itself if we pop out this brake pad. The piston right here that activates the brake pad, they are a nickel chrome plated piston and they are two and a half inches in diameter which is about 30% larger than a lot of the other brands and because they're larger it will give you more braking torque than the competition. And the brake pads that are installed on here, they are a high performance ceramic brake pad. We mentioned the mounting brackets that these will install to. They are a Dacromat coated mounting bracket, provide strength and durability. They do use a nice side support angle design to ensure the load is placed on the whole bracket, not just the bolts. And you can see these are designed to fit a four bolt brake flange mounting configuration on your axle. Now these are designed to fit 3,500 pound axles with the number 84 spindle. The wheel size that will fit on these is 13 inches and larger. We mentioned the bolt pattern is five on four and a half inches and the wheel lugs that install on these to hold your wheels in place. They are not included. We sell them separate. They use a half inch by 20 size wheel lug. But that should do it for the review on the Kodiak disc brake kit with the 10 inch Dacromat hub and rotors with the five on four and a half inch bolt pattern for 3,500 pound axles.